this? <laughs> right, let's go. I'll be worth a giggle. Yeah, so about 8 o'clock this morning, I'm like, rapidly trying to put these together. I'm like, quick, quick, quick got to go in a minute. Right. I mean, she's got a bit of a tailwind at the moment. Yeah, I think so. A shame because Gemma gave me carte blanche to buy pretty much whatever I wanted to. I might jump up to about 50 quid. <laughs> nah, it's nothing. It's only because we were going there. I thought it'd be nice to bring something back. But saying that, where will I carry it anyway? I guess I carry a wheel or something. Yeah.
think it is, isn't it? I wonder how many people live on here. Quite a lot by looks of it. Hey, sort of channel out. Up until this morning, he said he was going to, yeah. I hope no one tries to drive them down there. Huh? I hope no one tries to drive them down there. taken out this morning. Yeah. Yeah, just coming off the roundabout of Morrison's. So I was coming from the industrial park, coming across the roundabout, turning off left to go towards the Eastern Road. Some old guy coming out of Anchorage Park. And I thought, he's not slowing down. I thought, 
I bet he's going to do that annoying thing where they come off left as well and just come off right close to you. But nope, straight on. Fucking had to slam his brakes on, nearly hit me. He sort of went to him, what the fuck are you playing at? And he's just, you know, looking down. Good carries on driving. Yeah. Well, I was saying, it's odd so I said, the one time I... I because I thought we wanted to go into this, I thought I want to get as much on film as I can, so I won't turn my camera all the way down. Because you usually have one all the time. Yeah, and, and the one time, I was like, now I probably could have done with that on. Try. It's a nice route, we know where we're going. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I'm up for that. Well, Johnny said you found a place. To that cafe, yeah, that'll be nice. So we tore up gold, come back. Yeah. If it was a sunny one, I'd be saying no, come on, let's do this. Yeah, you'd be doing like 30 in this. We can do it next week, can't we? Yeah, we can do it whatever. All we need to do now is get you out of um, get you out of trainers into SPDs and get rid of the flash dance socks. What we thought, mate? Yeah, I can never remember. Yeah, after this white one. No, no, it's alright mate, you go.
London. So you can convince your mate to come along then. <laughs> I think there's some um, apprehension about hills and the wind is a bit high. Right in the middle. That way. Oh, no. What? Yeah. Okay. You got stuff to fix it, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> get coffees. Yeah, great. Well, you can go and get a coffee. I'll start doing this. No, 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 no. Just sit, sit outside the cafe. Do it. Sorry, don't do it here. Outside the cafe, mate. Oh, mate. Oh, well, don't worry. I just, I just clipped half my pedals off on the curb. How, how did you clip your pedals on the curb? You know I went past a car. Oh, just, when you tried to squeeze past that car? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And Shave quite a bit off. Come on, man. Come on. Let's get Tony's bike. Oh, sorry. sorry. Tony's bike sorted. Yeah. I think it's a shame. I, I just think it's... It's a shame that he just doesn't seem to be fussed about any of this anymore. You know, he's always ranting on about, we've got to do the Mega Meal, we should go and do the Isle of Wight, we should go and do this, we should go and do that. And he just, he never bothers anymore. You know, he, he, ne he will never make a commitment. You say to him, we're all going out, and we all commit, you know, Monday, Tuesday. 
<coughs> and right up until fucking Saturday morning, he's like, oh, excuse me, oh, I don't know, I might be busy, I might have plans. And I said, I keep saying to him, Neil, if you might have plans, they're obviously not that important. Yeah. You know, because if they were, you would have plans. Stay with I said, so if it's a might, then just move it, cancel it. Yeah. Do it on Sunday, do it next weekend. And then it's the same old story, half hour before you to go out, you get a text message, sorry guys, can't make it, I've got a lot of stuff to do, or I'm busy. We know it's not. No, because there's never any, I've got to go and do this, or I've got to go and do that, it's just busy, I've got plans. Yeah. I think once, I think that was when, um, when these guys came around the day before the sports team, we had a few beers. I think only once have I actually text or reply what was on my mind, which was, well, those hookers aren't going to kill themselves, are they? Someone's got to fill the dead hooker warehouse. Where's he going? This is what happens when you get older and your eyesight goes and you can only see long distances ahead, you ride into stuff that gives you punctures. What is driving to, anyway? I don't, I don't remember riding into anything. No, it's just one of those things, isn't it? It would have been one of those, um, I also reckon it was when that guy was cutting all the trees down. Oh, oh yeah. Tour de Greasy Cafe. Tour de Greasy Cafe. I like it. My other half does graphic design and one of the top she said, oh, I'll do you a logo. So she's she's done it, so I thought the least I could do is print it out and make these guys stick it on their bikes. It's brilliant. I like it. It's a full blowout, does it? It does, yes. Yeah. That's it, yeah. I like the way you think. That's really Enjoy your day. Nice to meet you, tell her. Yeah. I think we're better off on the road. Yeah, I think we should not have a bike on the end of the road. Yeah. We're just saying, I'm not sure we feel comfortable propping our bike up against graves. We're not on the top of the graves, are we? No. Yeah. We are kind of Check on the really land, though. I don't like it. You see that? Big fat old low rider. I think it's going to be cheap, you know? Say again? I think it's going to be cheap. No, I know. I mean, can you put a tiny bit in there?